Tom's just taking on the full blunt force of this fire. Hello and welcome guys, Salaviathan here, back with another reaction today here for the season finale of Dragon Age Absolution. We're on episode 6 and damn, this series was an intriguing one. It definitely wasn't one that is for everybody, but it definitely was for me. So I'm, I've, I enjoyed it immensely. <laughs> we were still kind of um planning the whole heist to, sorry, the whole prison break to kind of say Miriam in this case so everybody kind of had their own type of um, job that they have to do um, Amasine here was still kind of a little angry and everything he still wants to kind of revive Neb and it seemed as though like um, the thing that was keeping Neb alive wasn't really him being like a zombie but there was like some type of demon inside him or something you know we learned a little bit more about Hera and her ties to the to Vinter Imperium um, there was a lot of stuff that was uh, inferred here a little bit too as well Miriam came in trying to fight Neb and everything. We had a uh, Quidian going down to the altar to try to wake up the stone dragon, and then we had Lachlan and um, we had uh, Lachlan and Roland both kind of um, distracting the guards and fighting. Um, they started fighting Tasia, and Tasia was destroying them both. It was it was entertaining as heck. Now it seemed as though like the dragon started waking up. Everything was going kind of a little bit crazy. So it's definitely going to be interesting to see how we're going to conclude this series but um we're not gonna waste any time let's get started with this one don't forget to like share and subscribe guys turn on notifications down below so you know when i upload next and consider leaving a comment down below or dropping some more recommendations for other stuff since this is ending i'd love to hear some recommendations on, on other things that you guys would like to see but for that note we're not gonna waste any time let's get started with the season finale of dragon age absolution the price of salvation Let's go. Sweet, merciful, and just it. Having this damn stone dragon just waking up and just causing havoc. <laughs> Damn, she didn't hear him? Thank the Maker. I thought the dragon might have gotten you. <laughs> After I freed it? No way. They're not mindless murder machines. <sighs> if anything, I think we really bonded. Yo, what a homie! We should probably get moving too, you know, before. That is a completely unfair assumption. Bro, Tom's just taking on the full blunt force of this fire. This is my fault. I was so sure Miriam could see reason. I'm sorry, Neb. There can be no master without a slave. And no slave without a master. Oh my god, now he's gonna summon even more of them. It's time to take back what's mine. And then he did it again. What is wrong with this guy? Just let this guy rest in peace. Of course. I almost forgot the dragon. This guy's been diving and delving in dark magic his whole life. What is he doing? So many lives to bring one beast to heal. I knew it. He wasn't gonna stop the dragon. He was going to control the dragon. How did he? She will never forgive him for this. And they're all cheering like this is a good thing. No, it's Here not. It. Is anyone here? <laughs> K 
Okay, nice. I'm glad she secured the circulum and she's reuniting with them. Here. Oh, so worried they've taken you. Is that the circulum? It didn't seem safe to leave it here. But you were leaving? She was about to abandon all of them? But Hero was the betrayer the whole time? You didn't know the I didn't even you expect know. that. But I wanted to keep it safe. No, don't trust this bitch. Don't. No, Miriam. You were stealing it. This was never about reuniting with Miriam. That's why you changed the drop off. It was never about their Faye love. trapped you. He knew you were the traitor, and you killed him to cover it up. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for judging you, Fairbanks. I'm sorry. Just give me a chance to explain. There's a lot more to this. You know what the Venatori did to my family. After we escaped, I felt lost, helpless, until I heard about the Inquisition. It was perfect. And I was so sure that once we fixed the breach, we'd fix everything else. But I was wrong. The Inquisition was never going to stand up to Tevinter. They were too afraid of collateral damage. We're going to turn the Templars against Tevinter. Even the ones inside it. Burn everything to the ground and salt the earth. But we needed the Circulum to do it. Because the Circulum exchanges lives, so they're going to revive people by killing people into Vinter. I offered Rizarin a deal. He moved the Circulum to the palace. We were supposed to be caught in order to make the exchange. He needed it for some ritual, but afterwards he'd give it to me. We'd escape, and he'd scuttle the investigation. And you trusted him, just like that. I trusted myself. I am so surprised that she was that she would even work with Amazine or even make a deal with him. Of course it'd be a square deal then. Never. Yo, Lachlan is like, yo, I'm calling bullshit, bro. I smell bullshit. You'll have to forgive me. But what the fuck could you have offered him in return? Me. Miriam. That's what she offered. Oh my god. Wasn't it? She never loved her at all. Yes. I was never going to let him keep you. Oh, how thoughtful of you. Miriam, I swear you would have escaped. There was some stupid ritual he kept talking about, but afterward... You never sell up the people who actually were there for you for your own type of purposes, man. They came back ready to die for you, Yira. And now this damn dragon's coming in to ruin everything even more. Live. Restrain her. She may not be my favorite, but we're not leaving Miriam with that bastard. 100% man. Lachlan, Lachlan's the real one. He really is. There's no way one would act like this unless... It's being controlled. Guys, 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 guys. Uh, I know what we should do. We let them go? I would. Except that you made that impossible. So, when they all die screaming, I want you to remember that their deaths are all your fault. I can't believe he almost tricked me into thinking he was a good guy with good intentions. I <laughs> Neb? Bro, that's like a that's like a whole body worth of blood. What the hell? <laughs> what? I didn't expect any of that shit. I didn't get any of those vibes from either of them. Oh my god. I wonder is Quidian a stronger mage than Amacine? I feel like she's like on this on par with him. Flesh and blood. 
What? No, what are you doing to the dragon? But whose who's oh, life is he trying to exchange for this? Miriam's? Or the dragon's? It has to be. Brother! No, it's man. So to see you. Miriam. Nem, no. I'm sorry. I tried to save you. I'm sorry it wasn't enough, but. You can't come back. I love you. Nah, he's not. I don't think he's reviving. I think he's going to expel the demon out of him. No! Well, I'll be a hairy nug. I can't believe that actually worked. You ungrateful brother! You were mine! Satisfaction. Never. This guy needed you to were. die so much. If that thing wants a fight, I freely give it to her. No more death today. They aren't monsters, gods. They're just alive, like us. All I want is to be free. Zarin is dead. I have the circulum. It's over. If you want it to be. I just need you to say that I'm more important than this. I wish I could. Oh, that sucks. Shit. I guess Hera ran out of time before she could finish us Man, off. It feels like nobody has ever had Miriam's back, and that's never been truer than this scene right here. Hera made her choice. So have I. Without a dragon, it will cost dozens, hundreds of lives to power the Circulum. I have to destroy it before it gets to the Crimson Knight. You mean we have to destroy it? Uh, me too. You don't have to come here. I won't hold it against you. That makes one of us. So, where do we go now? I mean, Hira could be anywhere. Commander, I have a message from the Tevinter woman. She has the circuit, but is being pursued by enemy agents. They stand in the way of our righteous crusade against the Imperium and all it represents. Take whatever you need, kill these agents, and bring me the circular. I will have my war. Alrighty, guys. Okay. Honestly, good, good, solid way to end it, man. I didn't expect any of that. Um, the dragon kind of coming in the end there, just going and rampaging everything, was a great way to see like a lot of action. Especially the fact that the the dragon itself had like a bit of a conscience too. Amazine, all completely unhinged, just killing all of his agents and using their blood to kind of, kind of like control the dragon and stuff was was a pretty good ending as well too. And then even with like Hira being the traitor and Fairbanks actually like catching Hera not being the traitor or whatever was so weirdly interesting. Her whole goal was that she was working with Razan Amacine and her and she was gonna give up Miriam. Like that actually pissed me off so much because like every time 
every time like Miriam thinks that she has somebody but uh, like that has her back they go ahead and they betray her like always and and it seems as though like the people who are just right here with her right right here right now are the people who are going to be with her for her, the ones that are always going to be there for her you know that ending there was an interesting one kind of seeing how them trying to revive Neb and then it kind of failing the circulum getting taken in by Hera and, and she's taking it back to the Inquisition now I know this series goes into like the new Dragon Age game that's coming out but is this the end of Dragon, Absol Dragon Age Absolution or will there be more? Will there be a season 2? So we'll see, we'll see. This might be the last video for Dragon Age Absolution so if anybody enjoyed it I'm glad you did um, but for this video I think I'm gonna end it here. I will see you guys around, take care and have yourselves a great rest of your day. Bye bye.